Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my guitar blog. And about anything else that fucks your mind, basically. Um, today we're gonna start learning a song, or we're gonna hopefully finish it. Uh, it's a, no, it's an easy song. I'm joking. Rodriguez, Sugar Man, and you. Yeah, let's just start by playing it. I think you had a funny approach to this song as well because yeah, the story behind it. I will not go into that, but you know, guys, inform yourself about the songs. It's pretty nice. Okay, uh, the song starts. I'm gonna play it, and then later we're gonna break it down as usual, chord for chord, the guys. I'm in my professional studio, and let's record this shit up. Okay, and so far and so forth. Um, sorry for the singing. It's morning and I didn't know uh, should I take the effort to sing high or low. And yeah, you know, guys. Um, okay, the song starts with the voicing of the E minor here in the fifth fret. 5th fret barred the, the higher, musically higher free strings and you add your ring finger on the 7th on the D string and you get this very calm, decent sound and you do the rhythm like Okay, I'm doing down, pause play a bit around here and then you go on the second uh, chord which is barring the string still and you add your middle finger on the sixth fret on the D string and your pinky on the highest string on the E string on the seventh fret so it's from the beginning Try to play it very softly. Okay, and then you go to a D minor 7, which is like a normal D minor. 
but you lift your pinky. So it's and then there ha we have the seven shape uh, on the E. Sixth, seventh on the on the A string, sixth on the D string, and seventh again on the G string. And you play the rhythm, and then you add your pinky on the highest string on the seventh uh, fret again, like this. And you go to normal A minor. This was the intro, and now we go to the to the lyric part with A minor. Sugar man, won't you hurry? E major, D seven, D minor seven. minor I hope you know E major you should know by now as well uh, D minor 7 which is Barre the first two strings and you add your middle finger on the on the second fret on the G string you can play it with the open D from there so mute your other string and go back to the E major and A minor finally again. Sugar man, won't you hurry? Cause I'm tired of this. And again, for a blue coin, won't you bring back? The rhythm is sugar man. Okay, down, pause, up, down. You can have while the pauses, you can have a muted. Sometimes I do it a muted uh, strum if you feel like. It comes from your experience. Just do two down strokes. With a little bit of in between notes, but they're not really necessary. And then for the refrain, you go to from the E minor, A minor, sorry guys, I'm confusing notes today. A minor to the C. Silver, like C, silver, silver, two down strokes to the A minor, and D minor 7. Uh, okay, D minor 7 and F major. So. to the A minor, you don't play the D, you go immediately to the F. But instead of playing the chord, I just play the bass. So, first fret on the E string, then second string open, second string, or let's say fifth string, sorry for confusing you, Fifth string open, fifth string first fret, fifth string second fret. So it's like. And from this note, okay, let me try to, to play it for you. You 
transform this if you play it with your middle finger this final uh, note here you can transform this chord into the E major subconsciously you know and then uh, continue with the E major like and then I play one row of intro I don't know if it's correct but sounds good And back to the chorus uh, verse. And look at all those in between notes, how beautiful they make the song actually. This is the, the core of the song, I believe. And I hope you guys enjoyed this song. I hope it, it was worth for you. This is my version. I, People may write in the comment line, it's wrong, it's right, whatever, I don't care. For me it's right and I like to play it like this. If you're watching my video, you're probably gonna like it or not. But I'm doing my best. And yeah guys, I said I'm making a theoretical lesson about this. I will do it. I will do it soon. Uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Upvote, share if you want. If you don't want, I don't care. It's okay. We live in a century where I should accept it. Ah, I watched this movie yesterday. It's really stuck in my mind. Uh, the Brave New World. I don't know if you guys know it, but it's so crazy. Like it's, I don't know, maybe from the 90s. But the idea of having a civilization that is m only mostly about sexual and without love. So it's a very interesting movie to see it from their perspective from the 90s because it's actually exactly what I think what we're going to still and it's a kind of sad movie but in the end it's a very you should check it out just check it out it's a funny movie um, one other movie i want to suggest to you right now because we're talking about movies uh, is wild tales this one would really blow my mind sorry guys but this was amazing argentinian movie watch it it's pretty much worth it and uh, thank you for listening uh, have a nice day enjoy your uh, guitar with the song and thank you habibis <laughs>